a very warm welcome to my dear students we have so many places on the earth what if i want to locate a place on the earth the directions alone does not help us to accurately describe the location of a place that is why it became necessary to find a new system to state the precise location of any place on the earth and this new system is explained to us in this chapter the earth and the graticule oceanic waters and even nature of the land forests innumerable islands of different sizes and buildings make it impossible to actually draw such lines on the earth in order to overcome this difficulty geographers develop a miniature model of the earth in the form of a globe this can be used to determine locations on the earth if i draw lines horizontally on the skin of the orange dividing it into horizontal slices are called parallels of latitudes latitudes are parallel lines circle the earth from east to west these lines are same distance apart about 69 miles these 69 miles is 1 degree each degree is further divided into smaller lines these are 60 minutes in 1 degree and 60 second in 1 minute the equator lies in the 0 degree halfway between the north and south pole the equator bisects the earth into north and south parts the one to the north is called the northern hemisphere while the one to the south is called the southern hemisphere longitude are the imaginary lines which run vertically over the earth these lines are measured in the same way as parallels of latitudes the central one is the prime meridian there are 180 meridians in all they help in determining the time and location of the place the parallels and meridians on the globe form a net that is called a graticule this facilitates determining the location of a place thus with the help of latitude and longitude we determine the locations on the earth this method is been used even in today's modern age quite effectively This technology is also available on mobile phones and motor cars. Please complete the following activity. Thank you. Have a nice day.